Okay, welcome back to our Hot Sauce Sweet 16. We have completed two matchups, and starting tonight, we're gonna go through a couple for each video. So matchups three and four tonight. If you are new to this and you haven't seen the other videos, I haven't been following along. We are doing 16 hot sauces, matching them up in a bracket style tournament. Uh, these were whittled down from about 30 or so that I've tried and purchased and uh, tasted. So these are the 16 top ones that I have found that I like personally. Um, up until tonight, we've kind of done some pretty basic hot sauces that have a base of vinegar, cayenne pepper, red peppers, different spices like that. But now we're gonna start to get into some of the more exotic peppers and some different flavors. So this should be fun. Um, we're gonna do two matchups tonight, again, judging on uh, the heat, the taste, the complexity of the sauce, all the different factors. Um, and let me say again, uh, these are all hot sauces that I love and recommend and, and would definitely tell you to go out and buy. I'm just kind of really whittling it down to the cream of the crop here, what I like the best. Um, so that's where we're headed with this. So two matchups tonight. First here, we have Lola's, the jalapeno and serrano hot sauce, going up against Tactical Tacos Snafu, okay? Uh, this one obviously has a base of like it says, jalapeno and serrano, uh, as well as some other oils, vinegar, and um, it's got uh, red pepper and white pepper in it too. And then the snafu, this one is got jalapeno in it. It's got, uh, I believe it's got um, a green chili pepper in it and some other spices. So those are pretty evenly matched. And then over on this side, we're really gonna take a kibbit up a notch. This one, these two came from the bring the flavor region. These two come from the bring the heat region. These are two different ghost pepper sauces. Uh, this is Lola's ghost pepper sauce. Uh, kind of speaks for itself, obviously made with ghost peppers and other fine, delicious things. And then this is Tactical Taco's ghost protocol. So two ghost pepper based sauces going up from the bring the heat the division there tonight. So. That's what we have going on, and we'll get these done. I'll be posting the video on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, like I always do. Uh, there is a printable and uh, reviewable bracket for you that is already on Facebook and Twitter. You'll find it uh, linked in there. I'll put it in the thread um, so you can print up your own bracket and play along. And uh, Also, let me know if you've had any of these, which ones you like, what you enjoy. I'd be glad to hear from anybody uh, who wants to chime in. And again, we're tasting these with um, late July, multi-grain, plain corn chips, or multi-grain chips are not corn chips. So we've got a real solid base that's not gonna affect the flavor. So let's get right into it. Let's start with our contestants from the Bring the Flavor division. And we're gonna start tonight with the Snafu from Tactical Tacos. Um, this one has got, I think, a bit of a smoky taste to it, if I remember. Yeah. This has got some smoked pepper in there, some jalapeno. Um, not much in the way of vinegar in this one. It's mostly pepper, some oil. Really smooth at the front. You get the smokiness. Uh, you get the peppers, and then you get a real nice kind of a lift burn at the back of your throat um, once you've eaten this one. So it's very tasty. Um, I love smoky things. Anything that's smoked, I think it's great. This one goes good on just about anything. So, yeah, delicious. Ooh, but taking up a little heat. <clears throat> okay. And next comes Lola's uh, Jalapeno and Serrano. I love jalapeno peppers, one of my favorite peppers. Um, so we'll see how this one stacks up against the Snafu. A nice dip on here on the chip. Okay, you get that jalapeno burn right at the front and the Serrano flavor is in there. And then it just kind of disappears. There's not much else to it. It's tasty. I still like it, but it's not very complex. It's very basic with the Serrano. 
and the jalapeno. I don't get a lot of other flavors in there, not much in the way of heat, not really a slow burn. It tastes good, and that's about all I can say for it. It's a very, very good tasting sauce. If you like the taste of jalapeno, serrano peppers, anything like that, you want to put that on something, I highly recommend. Uh, but I think in this case, we're going to give the nod to the Snafu from Tackle Tacos. Uh, really, really good, very complex sauce, has many different flavors. The smokiness can't be beat, so um, they're the winner in this one. Okay, now we get to the serious stuff here. This is the Bring the Heat region, two different ghost pepper sauces, and both of these, when you look at them, they are much, much thicker than the other sauces. A lot less vinegar, a lot more pepper, a lot more ground vegetables in it, so, um, these will definitely be a, a little test for me. So let's start with the Tactical Taco Ghost Protocol. Let's see what we do there. The ghost peppers are really good. They became popular a few years ago and uh, everybody was talking about them and then all of a sudden uh, they came out with hotter peppers and the ghost pepper kind of took a back seat, but it's still a really, really good pepper. All right, that's got a nice bite at the front, um, really tasty, kind of a, a mellow version of a ghost pepper, I would say. Um, there is definitely some white pepper in there. Uh, there's definitely uh, some vinegar in there. And again, uh, sort of like this one from Lola's, it just kind of disappears. There's not much of a, um, as we say in the whiskey trade, there's not much of a finish to it. It just kind of goes away. <clears throat> It's tasty, definitely still something I like. <clears throat> Excuse me, all right. Now let's go with the Lola's ghost pepper. Let's see what we have going on here. Okay, that one immediately, it jumps out at you, kind of punches your tongue. With a nice spicy ghost pepper. Um, and there's a little bit of smokiness in there too, so they might do some smoked pepper in there. Uh, there is, um, I think I taste, uh, I, I tasted some yellow banana in Alola's um, the other night in another video, and I think I'm getting some yellow banana pepper in this one too. Um, kind of gives a little sweetness on top of the heat. Uh, lots of different things going on in this, and uh, the heat isn't overwhelming. But I would say of the, the sauces that I have sampled thus far in these videos, this one definitely has the most heat. I know there's hotter stuff to come, but of uh, these are eight now that we've tried, this one definitely has the most heat and it's kind of building up a nice smoke uh, in the back of my throat here. Woo, nice. Okay, so without a doubt in the ghost pepper matchup here on the Bring the Heat region Lola's, Ghost pepper sauce is the winner for sure. Um, that tactical taco snafu, that's really, really good. Again, a nice uh, smoked pepper taste uh, with uh, there's some jalapeno in there. And then this one is a ghost pepper that has got a lot of nice heat to it, but not too much. Um, okay, so those will crown those two tonight. We'll get another couple of matchups done later this week uh, as we head towards the, uh, the winner of this Sweet 16 hot sauce. You can follow me on Twitter at MCFansighted. Uh, also, we'll post on Facebook if you're my Facebook friend, and we'll have on YouTube. I have a YouTube channel. Um, it's Michael Collins, and uh, you'll see uh, the other videos on there. Um, you can subscribe to my channel. And uh, that's about it. The link will be in the videos that I post on social media. And hope you get to try some of these, and I hope to hear from you to tell me some of the sauces that you've had that you like.